So I changed my talk to the AB effect on optical activity. The purpose of the talk is to find the relationship among the optical activity, the Friday effect, and the AB effect. Uh, the optical activity medium has a dissimilarity structure under the influence of the instant electric field. The instant field constrains the motion of the electron along the uh, micro solid, uh, solid solid structure in the chain way. So that will induce the longitudinal magnetic field along the direction of propagation. And the left-handed uh, secondary polarized uh, wave inducing the magnetic field is in the opposition direction of the uh, left-hand secondary polarized back. So in this sense, we see that the optical activity is a Friday effect when the instant the beam is reflected back, the optical rotation is very uh, vanishes. And uh, in the normal Friday effect, the optical rotation is stopped after reflection. So the motion of the electron along the fringed space is affected by two forces. One is the Lorentz force, and the other is the centrifugal figure force. In the equilibrium condition, the two opposite uh, force is balanced. So we can give the expression as the angular momentum L uh, is proportional to the uh, velocity of the motion. And the magnet magnetic force phi is proportional to the angular momentum. In this case, we see that the AB phase or the belly phase gamma is proportional to the, is also proportional to the angular frequency. So this is an experimental confirmation between the, the valid constant and the rotator power for the alpha quads in the wavelength region from 0 0.2 to 2 micrometer, we see that the linear relation is observed between these two physical parameters. That means that induced uh, magnetic field in the alpha quads is about uh, 82 tesla. Due to the induced magnetic field in the propagation direction of the light, we see that the optical activity is a quantum effect. So we, we may probe the high number of quanta. So we propose an experimental setup to, reduce, to probe the, uh, the quantum effect in alpha quads and the minimum intensity uh, is the function of the, of the quantum effect. Uh, this is the experimental result of the minimum intensity as a function of the optic pace as a propagation pace along the direction of optic axis. We see that the, the quantum number for the optical activity is j equal to 3. And uh, the rotator power is proportional to the, to the AB phase gamma. We see that the uh, rotator power is, proportion, is proportional to the, to the AB effect and the gamma effect. The AB, the AB phase is proportional to the angular frequency. So because of the induced 
magnetic field in the optic axis, the motion of the electron in the optic active medium is affected by the Lorentz force. In this case, we see that the differential equation is a nonlinear equation. And, and this, this magnetic field will cause causes the Zeeman effect in the alpha quartz. The, the OH impurity in the alpha quartz, uh, quartz then provides a trace to probe the, the crystal field. We see that the splitting of the, of the infrared absorption band is observed in infrared barrage. The, the, the optician band is found to be nearly polarized and uh, the optical beta is observed in the, in the ferrogram. The beta frequency is equal to the, to the Lama frequency. So the, from above experiments and experiment results, we see the optical activity is a natural Friday effect in the AB effect. The AB or belly phase is proportional to the angular momentum of the electron around the micro solid solid in optical medium. And the AB phase is proportional to the total power. Thank you. Thank you very much.